everyone. Today, instead of making a cooking video, we're gonna teach you how to make an add-on to our table. What we're doing for today is we're adding extra storage because, well, we really need it because our table's not the biggest. We're going to be using this nice paint color when we paint it. We really like how it's like a sort of grayish green. We think it goes really well with the outdoor theme. And we're going to be starting by sanding all of our wood. We're using a hand sander because, well, honestly, we think it's more fun. And normal sanders can be very, very cool. This is what our paint is going to look like when it's all dry on our things. And this is not actually one of our pieces. That's just a thing to show you. Now we are going to start by painting our wood. We're going to use this nice color because we think it works really well. We're just finishing up our painting here. It's almost done. Doesn't the color look nice? Now we're going to start nailing these together. We're going to be using a nail gun. Just like that. This is what our finished thing will look like. It's all nailed. Now the only thing we have to do is nail it onto our table. Now we can all fill it with all of our favorite things. Now, since you stay till the end, we're going to give you a quick overview of our favorite garlic machine. What you do is you first open up this hatch and you put the garlic clove in. Then, this is the fun part, all you have to do is roll it back and forth. When you roll it back and forth, the wheels turn these blades and that is how it chops up the garlic. It makes really fine garlic and if we ever do a salmon video, we're going to need garlic for that and we're going to show you how it works in that video. And then, when you're done, you can take that out and take out the blade for easy cleaning. This is one of our favorite tools. We also like this, which can cut through any plastic bag that you have trouble cleaning through. And then, we have our lighter. We like X-Light lighters because they have a really powerful beam, and they mostly just create heat. I don't know if you can see those waves, but they're there. And sometimes they create flames. But definitely, it is powerful enough to start a fire. And then finally, we have these grabbers. We like to use these for hot sticks or for food that's in the fire. Be well, not when it's this dirty, but right now we use it for like moving wood onto the fire without getting our fingers dirty. And so yeah, all these are very useful. And we hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching and Bye. we'll see you in our next video. Bye. Bye. Bye.